it really feels like that too. The texture mm -hmm. is really not what I expected. That's so fascinating. So does this stay solid for the whole launch? How it does, does it get burned? This maintains its integrity during the entire burn process. And this actually, if you remember, we just looked at the uh, SpaceX rocket. Yep. That one's a liquid. Right. This one's a solid. A space shuttle use liquid oxygen and liquid hydrogen. A lot of people like that one because it's got really high performance. The specific impulse is really high. There's kerosene That's motors. The other one. one of the things we're looking at on the moon is hypergolic propellant, which uh, when you combine, you don't need an igniter. When you combine the oxidizer mm -hmm. and the fuel, it just self-ignites. And oh, so we okay. want to do that on the moon. And I think there's some real advantages. You think of it as a long tube okay. and there's a center hole in that that runs the entire length of that tube. And uh, then there's some fin slots and stuff like that in there. But there's an igniter at the forward end, typically. And the solid boosters, they're just ready to go at all times.